The number line drag and drop question allows students to drag points or images from a predefined list to the number line. Firstly, we begin by entering in the instructions to the Compose question area. Now we can set the lines minimum and maximum values as seen here. We can add a title to the number line or choose to leave it blank. Now we can add our possible responses. Here we enter in the values that will appear in the list under the number line. The student will then be able to drag and drop these into the number line to answer the question. You can add more possible responses by hitting the blue plus add button. And to remove them, just hit the delete button. As you can see here, I have entered points in the possible responses list that do not exist on the number line. This is because by default, the ticks distance is set to one. To change this, scroll down to the ticks section and change this to one over two. As you can see, the ticks appear every half point on the number line. We are now ready to validate our question. We can scroll back up to the set correct answers section. Here you will see the number line and the possible responses. Now we simply drag the correct responses to the number line and the validation is set. There are additional settings available also. You can set the number line width and height. You can set the frequency for the labels. For instance, if I set this to two, labels will appear on every second tick. Once you are happy with your content, your question is now ready to be saved.